five things narcissists must do before they discard you. There are certain things narcissists must do before they discard you, which can help you to identify if you are about to be discarded. And it can also help you to identify if you are really dealing with a narcissist, because these are things that they will all do. They have to do it to prepare you for the discard phase so that they can leave unscathed without suffering any injury, damage or harm. One, get what they want. Before the narcissist discards you, they have to get what they want. They have to get you to invest something into them. They have to get something. The narcissist cannot expend their energy for nothing. They have to get something back in return. Even though they may not have done anything for you. They may have caused you all kinds of problems. They expect you to see it as a privilege to be around them. And they expect something from you in return for them giving you that privilege. Two, devalue. Before the narcissist discards you, they have to devalue you. Narcissists see things in black and white. You're either all good or all bad, right or wrong, perfect or flawed. And for them to be able to move on, they have to see you as being all bad. They have to see it as though something is wrong with you. They have to devalue you. So they will insult you. They will put you down. They will treat you with contempt because they're already preparing you for the discard. And if they're doing that to you, that means they're already idealizing someone else. Three, new supply. When the narcissist starts to devalue you, in most cases, they already have the new supply lined up. They're already waiting in the wings. But first, the narcissist has to ensure that the new supply is ready to replace you. They have to ensure that the new supply is going to be a suitable replacement. And while they're doing that, they will continue to devalue you. They will continue to point out everything that they think is wrong with you. Four, discredit you. Before the narcissist can discard you, they must discredit you. They must assassinate your character. They must set you up for failure and humiliation. They must damage your reputation. 
so that they can get everyone else to see you the same way. When the narcissist discards you, they don't want other people to see it as though they're doing something wrong. They want people to think you're crazy. They want people to think that something is wrong with you. So before they discard you, they must discredit you. Five, no closure. The narcissist will discard you when they no longer have any use for you. But they understand that their victims can recover from the abuse. They understand that you can rebuild. So rather than cutting you off completely, they want to keep you on the shelf for future use. And they do that by giving you no closure. It leaves the door open so that they can come back if they need you again in the future. But they also use it to keep you in a state of confusion. To keep you guessing. To keep you wondering what went wrong. They use it as a form of mental torture because they understand that it plays on your mind. So when the narcissist is getting ready to discard you, they won't give you a reasonable explanation for what they're doing to you. Or they will give you a reason that is not justifiable. They won't give you a complete answer so that it leaves the door open for them to come back. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching at narcsurvivor.co.uk. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.